ass so too. You know, he they're the ones that's gonna get the biggest ass whooping when the time comes. Yeah, I you know. know. They gonna get it, man. They gonna get it, man. Let me ask you, you in the ring? Huh? Back. I actually, I that and that's not from that, but I actually used to be in the Marines long, long time ago. Right, right, right. Once upon a time, Army. Oh yeah. yeah. Oh yeah. We used to laugh at you guys. Uh, not too we made, We made fun in the Army. It's like, nah. <laughs> I don't give a fuck about none of that shit. You know, the Marines. Yeah. What you do? You get paid to go kill people. Oh man. You know? Shoot. To go kill some people that did do nothing wrong to us. Go steal their resources. You know. First Peter 3 and 15, but sanctify the Lord God in your hearts. Be ready always to give an answer. Ooh, that's fire. That's fire scripture. <laughs> so why do you think they always ignore us, man? Because they're not we, in the Word. They're not ready. Not in the Word. Right, when we walk up on with our cameras rolling, they pack up and go. Yeah, we got you know? videos too, because we asked, this brother right here asked him a question. <laughs> we you, guys are, you guys are on YouTube. Yeah. yeah. You guys travel statewide or is it just here in Ohio? I mean, we don't see brothers. They got, bro they, they got a big old uh, camp up in uh, Cleveland. I, the only reason I ask is because I've recently seen a group of the Hebrew Israelites that were, I'm not going to say warring against other Hebrew Israelites, but it was, it was like, I've seen you guys run some guys off the streets before. And, that, and, that's, and they know me specifically by face and by name. They don't. They don't speak to me. They don't acknowledge me. They will book up and try to either a will get hostile, like they want to fight. Yeah, that's the wrong spirit. That sounds like comfy sports. Comfy oh, yeah. sports is more violent than anything. If they don't. They won't talk to you. You know why they can't want to talk to you? Because they ain't got no answer. They, they want to preach at you. They, it's not even preaching at you. They just want to shout a whole bunch of stuff that they. They, they want just, to they shout just, a whole bunch of ideas. They just parroting, but because they don't really, they don't really know the truth. Like, they don't really see, but they just repeating what they was taught. And they, you know what I mean? They're not actually studying and doing none on their own. They're, they're like when zombies. You're the, when you're in the ecclesia, and that's the, that's the Hebrew Greek word for a calling out. The gathering. Call, yes, yeah. the gathering. When you, when you have the ecclesia in the streets, like how you are, you guys are opening up not only what what Yeshua meant for go ye therefore he's, he's blatantly saying it's not what happened in the upper room that we're supposed to mimic and imitate on Sundays it's when they left is oh we weren't in there drunk I promise it was the spirit I, gotta stop I, I, want, I want you to that's what the, the whole that's what I, mean, I, gotta, I gotta say one thing though it's the, the Lord the son of the most high his name is Yahweh Shah it's not Yahshua I can prove that. I can prove that. I, I speak Aramaic, so that's right. You're right. It's your house shot. Yeah. It's not Yahshua. And that's the the uh, the friendly. The, the, it's easy to it's accept. Easy that name. Yeah. His name is Yahshua. That's the, we just going heavy into that. Cause IUIC the dudes are purple. Yeah. They'll say you're wicked if you call the Lord Yahweh shot, and they make you call him Christ. They'll say Christ this, Christ that. Nate made a video. You know who their leader is, Nate. The leader of the IUIC. A young guy. He said, I never heard of everybody I ever heard calling your house I was wicked. But yeah, they refute and they all give each other Hebrew names. They all got Hebrew names, but they make you call the Lord Christ a Greek name. You see how they do that? But you gotta watch out for these guys out here, man. That's the literal meaning of the uh, wolves and the uh, sheep clothes. They come out dressed all nice, looking all fly, $500 garments. You know what I mean? That's how they lure people in. And then the whole thing is, all you need is your friends. <laughs> That's it. Really, all you need is the word. The word. Because really, the word is the fringes. Really, when you're at a deeper level, because the, the fringes represent the commandments with the word. Yeah. And we ain't people like I got no money out here buying all these fly garments and stuff. We just call garments beyond that. It's deeper than that. He speaks about that being that being a wicked that being a wicked people. He said it about how the scribes and Pharisees enlarged their uh, borders. You know, they, what did it say? Hey, let's give me that. Uh, did you about to get something? Oh, that's cool. Matthew 11. 
definition of what we call church because at the end of the day yes the ministry that you guys have doesn't reach the ministry that I come we from. reach everything I, the thing is so because you ain't got to go to all these fancy classes they don't know the truth up in them classes they're not going to be able to give you all the truth up in there but it gives me an idea they, they might have study, they might be able to teach you a couple greek words and you know i mean give you a little history but they don't know that they ain't got the truth up in there the, the, the truth come from the apostles and the, the prophets. Boom. Now that that is the one thing I will say this. That I take pride in that because that's the first thing that they were teaching us in the fivefold ministry. Is what is the apostle? What is the job of an apostle? The apostle is to go out, one who is sent. Sent out. He's sent out and he goes, and he's not just building churches and he's leaving them, but he's going and he's doing the Matthew, he's doing the Mark, he's doing the Luke. He's going and he's reaching the people and establishing like what Timothy was doing when he had to go back to Corinth and he had to explain to them, this is what you guys have failed to do. This is what you guys have kept up doing. This is what you guys need to change. He went to go then perfect the doctrine that they had received to show them where they were lacking. But that, let me ask you this, missing. that little course you're going to, who are they connected to? What church? It's an organization of churches. An organization of churches? I mean, what church though? A certain denomination or something? Out here, always they're, for the rainy They're non-denominational. Non they're non-denominational, but my, the church that I belong to, um, he just did one of the courses, another one of the bishops, uh, another one of the pastors from another uh, church, he just did another one of them. But the church that I belong to, we're a non-denominational. Because I, I mean, we are the not we do have a nomination. Because the nomination means name. It means you don't have a name. We do have a name, which is Israel. That's our nomination. Because that comes from the Latin uh, nomen, which means name. Right. So when you say you're non denominational, that means you ain't got a name. That guy's that song, uh, 83. No protection. Get that, get that. No protection. Yeah. Hey, 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 and they got the name of the most high either. Because it. They like this, yeah. So they're going off on that. So here's my question. Well, I take that for this, so here's my question as far as denomination goes. If my people who are called by my name, is what he said, then I get it that we are called the children of Israel. We are the children of Israel. That is, is that then being the denomination is what you're calling that? Is the children of Israel oh. be the children of Israel or? We ain't got none of them. We're a nation of people. All these other words and stuff they come up with, they don't mean nothing. We're the nation of Israel. The Lord said, I came only for the lost sheep of the house of Israel. Period. Right. That's in the book of Matthew, the 15th, the 10th chapter. chapter. We got all kinds of scriptures on it. It's all through that, right. You know what I mean? So it's clear we are Israel. In the New Testament, how they talk about this New Testament shit, they talk about the word change. The Lord is still the same. It's only coming for the children of Israel. Yeah. That's, that's it. That's clear. You know, these churches don't understand that. And we're not supposed to call ourselves nothing else. It ain't nowhere it said call yourself Baptists or Lutherans or have no name at all. These organizations are the only distant word, man. They against the truth. Because they what's that scripture? Always learning but never coming to the truth. There you go. You know? Right. They, coming to the knowledge like they, they got these courses, we're gonna sign so you up for the program. And then denying the and then, yeah. and then, and then denying the power thereof. Right. So you gotta separate yourself from these type of people. All them programs and courses and all that. Right. Well, I, 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 I take that and I, and I'll, 
I'll accept that. It's really the truth. But I'm only going. I'm only going right now strictly for the sole purpose of gathering the knowledge that my father put in me. My father was very, very adamant about the word. He was a minister. I, I, I'm not even going to shorthand. And really, if you want to get some knowledge, you got the internet, bro. Right. You know what I'm saying? You know how much it's, the knowledge, the resources is unlimited. The question that I have is going through the internet is what is perceivable and then what is also the knowledge that you well, that you, got, you share with the brotherhood that's why i go well, that's you why gotta, i go to use the bible as a, a filter school. but yeah there's a filter you got a filter yeah you know what but I, mean? I start i start with a fundamental i need to hear i need to hear the doctor well this is the fundamental what we're doing this is the doctor because like the scriptures say you can build your house on a rock you can't build your house out in the out in the sandy seashore right. you know what i'm saying that's all them uh, them seminary schools and programs and courses. Yeah, they, that's a house built on a sandy seashore. That's gonna float away to the ocean. Yeah, you start to tear that shit apart. Yeah. Let me. Yeah. This is 2 Corinthians 6 and 14. Be ye not unequally yoked together with unbelievers. For what fellowship have righteousness with unrighteousness? And what communion have light with darkness? You know? And that's the thing. We I, 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 mean, I don't even know how I say this, but I, I actually do uh, adamantly, I study adamantly where I'm at, and I'm not taking anything away from it, but from my knowledge, I can't just change what I know overnight. Of course not, nobody can what's up, brother. Come on, come on, brother, come on, come on. You know what? Hey, they don't know. They will. They will. You feel me? But I, I see what you say, though, because, look, every man got to walk his own path. You know what I'm saying? You know, and ain't nobody going to get it all overnight. You know what I'm saying? Regardless, you've been marked. Because when the time comes, well, you're going to be judged on what you know. What and we, you know. we try to give you the straight doctrine, the right. straight way. You know what I mean? The truth is, the Lord's coming to kill these motherfuckers. <laughs> you it's know about, what I'm saying? It's about, get, kill. it's about to get gruesome out here. Right, right, right. You gotta accept the truth, man. You know, ain't no straddling the fence. Yeah. You know? That's why the Lord got us out here. That's you know right. what I mean? That's right. We're not boasting or nothing, but we know this Bible. We know this truth. Okay? We know that the Lord got us out here for a reason. We know that what we teach, we got that sound doctrine. What you got? It's, uh, John 3 3. How was I answered and said unto him, Rarely, rarely I say unto you, unto thee, Except the man be born again, he could not see the kingdom of God. Right, so like, anything you knew before, like, you might still believe in the Bible, but you got, you got to get rid of all them old doctrines and stuff and, and put on that new garment. You got, you got to take that old raggedy garment, throw, throw it in the trash, and put on that new garment. You know what I mean? You yeah. humble yourself. Yep. Because any man, uh, any man with sense, a smart man, will realize he don't know shit. Yep. You know what I mean? That's a wise man. That's a hard thing. Like I said, this doctrine, we got a sound, bro. Ain't nobody ever proved us wrong. It never happened, never gonna happen. Because we know what we say is we've been gifted with the truth. As verse 4 it says, Nicodemus said unto him, How can a man be born when he is old? Except to be born back to the poor. We said, No. He said, It's. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. Go ahead. Said, can, can he enter the second time to his mother's womb? Right. And be born? <laughs> and I was shy, answered, Verily, verily, I say unto you, like to thee, and said the man be born of water and of the spirit, he cannot enter into the kingdom That's of God. That's why they baptize you under the water. That's all symbolic. You gotta come back. That's all symbolic. It's coming back. It's good. You were born in out of the water. We came through, we passed through water. The Lord actually, Yahweh Shai gonna baptize you with fire. Right. <laughs> See? John the Baptist baptized with water. That's what we're going through, being baptized with fire. Man. Yeah, yeah, man. It's fire, fire boy. Yes. You, you know. got to try that gold through the fire. Hey, look, I got a fire scripture. You're talking about fire. I'm going to baptize you with some fire. Okay. Okay. Uh, this is 1 Corinthians uh, 1 and 10. Now, this is a key scripture. So, this is why I say we got the truth. That what we teaching is the, the, the real. There's only one doctrine. It's because you, you either got 100% truth or you got no truth. Cause if you got 98% truth, that's half the 2% lies, that's not the that's truth. That's half truth, right. Well, I'm gonna show you, this is, this is real important. First Corinthians 1 and 10. Now I beseech you, brethren, 
by the name of our Lord, Yahweh Shai Mashiach, which is the true way to say his Hebrew name. And I beseech you, brethren, by the name of our Lord, Yahweh Shai Mashiach, that ye all speak the same thing, <laughs> and, that be, and that there be no divisions among you, but that ye be perfectly joined together in the same mind and the same judgment. Very so we all believe in exactly on uh, every key little tiny little point of every doctrine we all agree uh, agree the exact same thing but, but what i'm saying though you got all these different churches like in schools yeah. and courses you're gonna have all people in these courses in the schools they all got different theological views different beliefs why, on each doctrine you, you caught me when you said the vatican is going to be gone they're going to do away with it that, the oh, they, oh yeah and, and i'm gonna tell you why because constantine came with this idea to say, oh, well, they, we have to give them something to be happy with. And they came and gave us religion. That's a big bullshit. He yeah. didn't give us religion. He gave us the spirit. Not once. He showed it to him. He gave it to him in the, by breathing. He said, I breathe, I breathe on them. And they received it. Then it fell upon them in the upper room. Right. How is the spirit a religion when we as a tripartite man have the ability to respond right so you talking about religion but you try to go to these religious study courses oh man i, I, but so I, don't, look at, I don't look at them like that but and, that's, and this is why and, i see it but but none of them either and this Did is you why get grants and loans to go there no this is my church my actually my church actually put me through this i played an organ for my, okay. for my church what church uh living waters christian fellowship Reserving. Uh, Bishop Les Leslie Sims on the in the 21st. So you get down on them keys, you begin it in. I try. I, I, I let the spirit move. All right. <laughs> Can I read this real quick? Isaiah yeah. 8 and 20. Yeah. To the law and to the testimony. If they speak not according to this word, it is because there is no light in them. So yeah. let me ask you a question. Your church, what do they teach concerning the relationship between the Father and the Son? That's what we're on now, relationships, everything. What it, your relationships. Like, did they, did, do y'all teach the Trinity? I, teach I the, come out of that. I come out of the Trinity uh, ministry. Um, and, and, and people don't, and, and don't laugh when I say this, but I, I give the utmost respect to a lot of the people that have taught, not by their church size, not by their congregation, by the members of the congregation and themselves that make up the church. I sat under uh, Pastor Parsley for quite some time. My parents were Parsley. Um, and 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 I, I hear You're talking I, about Rob Parsley. I, I hear a lot about the ministry and everything, but I take this one thing for fact. They taught first. Who? The the, the ministry taught. Rob Parsley. What you mean they taught? Taught. I went to the. You I say they to, taught? They taught, as in school. But the, the, the thing is, they ain't teaching nothing. Up there with teaching the truth, bro. Up there with a clean, safe place. Here's, here's, here's the thing, though. Here's, here's my question, though. Yeah. How can one mock a ministry like that? Because Easy. it's not the Look truth. It. I mock the hell out of it. Right. Because it's not the truth. It's not of the truth. The, the, Lord going to, the Lord going to destroy him, burn him with fire, and then he going to laugh yeah, at him. Right. Okay. Now, I mean, now, we being now, real with now, you. Now, now, here's the only reason. Here's Elijah. Now, I, 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 I'm only going to ask this. I'm only asking questions. Let me get Rob Parsley. I used to watch Rob Parsley. I'm not talking me about too. watching him. I'm not talking but about no, him. I ain't never once had ever heard him say that the Lord came to save the children of Israel. Hey, hey. I ain't never heard him tell us that we're Israelites. I'm going to tell you the one, never thing, once. Tell you one thing that he's not going to do. He's not going to publicly broadcast that to people. Why? Because he sold well, it out. Well, he's under oh. a 501c3 tax Time, time, time. Oh, no. time. Nah, but bro. you're not allowed to just... Blatantly, if you take a school time, you're not allowed to blatantly take a school curriculum that I was subjected to from third to eighth, and I'm learning the alphabet. I'm learning everything key essential to the word and doctrine. You can't take that away from a ministry that is really doing it. Let me reassure you. If they're not you. doing it, that's you can't falsify that. You can't falsify. I'm gonna show doctrine. you something though, brother. Look, that's I'm, why I say that. You I'm can't gonna show you what the doctrine. Lord Himself commanded His apostles and disciples. Listen to this. This is a commandment. Matthew 10 and 5. These 12 Yahweh Shai set forth and commanded them. Right here. Okay, right. We was commanded to them. make teachers? No. These 12 Yahweh Shai sent forth and commanded them, saying, Go not into the way of the Gentiles, Ooh. 
and into any city the Samaritans enter ye not, but go rather to the lost sheep of the house of Israel. Can, let me listen. And as ye go preach, saying the kingdom of heaven is at hand. So we was commanded to go to it. That's the. This is like the first thing when when he went to send him out of teeth. That. That's now, the first I'm thing not, he I'm told not, him. Now here's my question to you: Who did who does he preach to? Who? To Israel. Now who does who does Parsley preach to? Bunch of it, heathens uh, and uh, Edomites uh, and devils. Yeah, everybody. And the Jew and Gentile. Right, right. Well, whoever there, whoever whoever going to give the biggest. That's the Jew and Gentile. Hey. No 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 no. And what no, was no, Parsley's no. favorite line though? You gotta sow your seed of faith. Yeah, yeah. We just get them, giving them yeah. checks. Right, gotta get right. them checks. I, I I hear y'all on that aspect of things. Hey, like Sister Mary, look under your chair. The Lord has blessed you. Who's the Sister Gentiles in the scriptures? Those that were not Jews, born of Jews. <laughs> no, but they were adopted under Christ. Is that it? Uh, Who's adopted? Yeah. Who's adopted? The Jew and the Gentile. They don't say that. Where do we say that? What? So who is saved by grace? Then who is saved by grace? Israel. The Galatians said that. Grace said that Lord came for uh, grace. Israel. Israel. Yep. We're going to show so you. So we, then the people that are adopted by what? By faith. Who's adopted Israel. By faith? We read it. Who was adopted? Israelites. Let, that's not just this. Listen, listen, brother. Then, then that's, that, but, but the new thing. We're going to read it. That would be it. everyone. No, no. we're going to read it. Let him read it. Okay. This is what the scripture says. Romans 9 and 4. Hey, we're going to say, prove all things. Remember? Okay. Who are Israelites? So, read that again. Start at, nine and, uh, start at the top, 9 and 1. It says, I say, I say the truth for the Messiah, I lie not. My conscience also bear me witness in the Holy Spirit. That I have great uh, heaviness and continuous sorrow in my heart. So I could wish that myself were a curse from the Messiah my, from my brethren, my kinsmen, according to the flesh. According to the flesh. Listen, he said, I wish I was a curse from my brethren. Continue. Who are Israelites? Who are Israelites? So he said his brothers are Israelites. Right, it's, I it's got the that. Apostle Paul. Right. So Continue. Who goes, to, to whom? To whom pertaineth the adoption? Oh, he said, to who are Israelites? To whom pertaineth the adoption? So Read that who's again. adopted? It, it just said it. Read it again. Who are Israelites? Who are Israelites? Continue. To whom pertaineth the adoption? Okay, go ahead. And the glory. And the glory. And the covenant. And the co what covenants? The old covenant, the new covenant. What's the, what's now, the word, what's the the word thing, New though. Testament? What did he do with the Hold old up, covenant? He, sir. he gave away with Anybody? the old covenant when he came in. Well, when, when, when Jesus Christ, Christ, when Jesus Christ hey, came, hey. that was the redemption He just said that all the covenants was for Israel right what's there. The, the, what does the word New Testament mean? What does the word New, what's the word Testament new. mean? No, what's the oh, word testify? Testimony means speak. covenant. Testimony yeah. means oh, covenant. Okay. So when you could, yeah, and the testimony. I'm just a little sight. I ain't mad. No, it's okay. But when the Lord said, this is my blood, the New Testament. There was other the words new he covenant. said, this is the new covenant. Yep. Yeah. So the opposite right. the Lord only died for Israel. Right. Read it again. Yeah, but you got to listen, though. Who then is saved by grace? Mm -hmm. it's, the same it's people. No, that man that stood next to him on that cross was not an Israelite. Yes, no, he, he was adopted by grace. He was not. So you're saying that all people is not going to go to heaven? Are you believing only on this? Heaven. Hold on, hold on. We tell you. Yeah, no. What? Heaven. That's a whole other subject right okay, there. Okay, we'll just call it glory. Okay, it, glory. Go ahead. Go because ahead. I, I, I'm, I'm not. I, I don't come. I don't come to. But let me read again. That again. I'm not trying to. You got to listen to the argument or anything. No, nah, right. I want to find out what you I said, know is some fact. Mm -hmm. it, so this is not fact. Read no, it again. No, I'm, I'm not saying it's not fact because that is the word that I'm coming from. Well, read it again. That's the same doctrine that I, that I believe in. So, so, listen, hold up, brother. Hold up, brother. Hold up. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I just want li li listen. Yeah, yeah. Go ahead. Listen, read it. Read it from uh, who are Israelites? Who are Israelites? Who are Israelites? Who are? To whom pertaineth the adoption? So it says to whom it say the adoption pertains to Israel. That's what it says. Right. So well then why is the word then you meaning to say that the word would contradict itself by it saying that we all No the word does we, not contradict okay, itself. Then because then it, okay, then it. being we all if we accept Jesus we Christ We all You can't accept it. Nobody can accept the Israel Lord. Israel is his own world. The Lord accepts what you. So what did he say to Esau? He, he said, said, for I've well, treated you. Exactly. But I've dealt with you. What does no, that he mean? never he said he dealt with Esau. He, hey, get wrong, keep going on that. Go wrong for your brother I love. What? Hey, brother, listen. Said, and I've listen, dealt listen, with listen, you. Brother. I know the word. Yeah. Yeah. Listen to this. Said, right? I know the word. He listen. said, for I dealt with you. He him, never said that. Listen. I love, I love your brother. Listen. Jacob have I loved. Jacob have I loved. Esau I have hated. So continue. He now, said he hates go, Esau. He now, never. He go hates to the Esau. Old Testament. What shall we say? Go then? to the Old Testament. Okay, right? I got because you can tie that back. We can do that. that. Mm -hmm. The Old Testament go that, hard. Uh, numbers twenty. I want to know Jeez. what you want to know. Who who are 
Would you say the chosen people? The Israel. Or, Israelites. I, I see. I know who okay, that is. Okay, the Israelites are the chosen but people. But who are those but, but that we, aren't saved? So you, right, right. Hold up. Who can't be saved? Who, Esau who is not able to be saved? Yeah, just tell us that. Who, e Esau who is able be to be saved? saved? Help me. Israel. Just Israelites. Israel. We're not. Let me be more specific. Just the elect of Israel. Oh, not yeah. all of Israel. We're not. Just There's the one. elect. You an Israelite. Right. Okay. I follow that. I'm following. But we can't tell you if you are the elect, though. But you are definitely an Israelite. Yeah, yeah. I follow y'all, man. Right, there are okay. those in Israel that's not follow Israel. That. I follow Yeah, okay. Let me ask you a question. Can Edomites be saved? If Edomites, can he be saved or not? I, I, if the I, Lord came to save all nations, can Edomites be saved? Yes. Let me read the scripture. Obadiah 8, well, listen up. Well, Obadiah I, I 18. The, Edom, the Edomite was cursed. Well, let's listen to, to it. To the ends of the earth. Well, I'm going to read it. That's, that's the only, the that's the. Let me get edification. Most high bless. All right, brother. All right now. I'm going to read it for uh, edification. Obadiah 18. In the house of Jacob shall be a fire. In the house of Joseph a flame. In the house of Esau for stubble. And they shall kindle in them Stop. and devour Stop. them. Yeah. Listen, the yeah. Yeah. and there shall not be any remaining in the house of Esau, for the Lord has spoken it. Ooh. So how can everybody be saved of all Edomites going to be wiped off the face of the earth? Right. Here you go, Malachi. That's the, that's the authorized. Malachi 1. That's the KJV. It, all, all Bibles say the same thing. Go look it up. Obadiah 18. Malachi 1 and 1, the burden of the word of the Lord to Israel by Malachi. The burden of the word of the Lord to Israel by Malachi. I have loved you, said the Lord, yet you say, wherein hast thou loved us? Was not Esau Jacob's brother? So was not Esau Jacob's brother? Say the Lord. Say the Lord. Yet I love Jacob. I love Jacob. And I hated Esau. The Lord hate Esau. And laid his mountains and his hair and his waist for the dragons of the wilderness. Whereas Edom saith, Esau getting laid waste. Not, I'm whereas not Edom saith, working with him. He's whereas, a blessing. Whereas he Edom saith, we are impoverished, but we will return and build the desolate places. Listen. Thus saith the Lord of hosts, they shall build, but I will throw down, and they shall call them the border of wickedness, and the people against whom the Lord hath indignation forever forever right. so they know so the I lord he ain't coming I for all that. nations bro that. Hebrews 12. You know that? that's the only question that i was asking is that's all good bro. who can be saved now nah, esau you know I, I, I get that's that. proof right there the Edom's lord's going into slavery bro. man Edom's going into slavery after that is it necessarily so the specific name or culture of said nation or is it necessarily so just the the bloodline the seed or the you know behaviors of well that too said but, people that no but the, the actual bloodline of the good. Edomites yeah. is the actual bloodline of the Edomites going back to the seed from the you know from the, from the sperm they going to be wiped out well we go the only reason why I can I, I, I take into that is because we go back into that deep, that lineage and it takes you back to that. Which back to what? Well, the seed of Israel gonna be saved. I got a scripture for that. I'll show you about the seed. About the fruit, you should know it. Go ahead. Galatians four and five says, to redeem them, I'm sorry, four, but when the fullness of the time was come, God sent forth his son, made of a woman, made us like it, made under the law, to redeem them that were under the law, that we might receive the adoption of sons. Who was under the law? Israel. There you go. Nah, he also said under the law. Which, what was that? Which one was hey, that? Look, them Gentiles you hear about in the New Testament, those is Israelites. Oh, sorry, brother. Go ahead, uh. oh, I was just yeah. What people don't understand is those Gentiles, what Paul was teaching, like in the Romans, the Galatians, those is actually Israelites who got scattered. So if you know the scriptures in the Old Testament, the Lord cursed Israel. He said, if you don't follow my commandments, I'm going to scatter you among all nations. Like, like the Greeks in the New Testament, those are actually Israelites. There's, there's a scripture to tell you that. that, that the Spartan, the scriptures say that the Spartans descend from the Jews. Okay? So we know for a fact all, all the, the Greeks, those were the Israelites, those Galatians who are actually Celtic people, because the uh, Gaul, the Gaul, the Galatians. That's, a, that's actually another word for Celtic. Those are Israelites, okay? 
So all the people Paul was teaching was all Israelite. Timothy was an Israelite. Titus was an Israelite. So that's why Paul was teaching them to wake them back up to the truth. He was bringing them he back. Was calling to, the, he was calling them hey, back to the truth. Hey, back to the remembrance. Right. Cornelius was an Israelite. Cornelius is an Israelite. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And what he was, and like you just said, all he was doing was bringing them back to their lineages. Yeah. And that, and that was what I said when he went back to Corinth. That was the one thing that he was he was showing them how they were dealing with themselves within their church. And I'm gonna call it church for lack of a right. Uh, it is a church, church. Right. But, but it was it was the there was right. their version of their echo their their meeting right. place. So what are we going wrong then? You see what I'm saying? So where are we going wrong? It's I'm not gonna say I'm not gonna say it's where we're going wrong. It's because you try and say all nations could be saved. That's not in the scriptures. Every 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 person has been given salvation at their feet. Boom! I just no. read it. I literally just read it. He said no. Okay, break this down. No, 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 I'm down. not saying that. I'm not talking about That's nations. what man teaches. I mean, not, you, not, if you want to believe that, you can believe that. Wait, who, who, who did the Son of God come from? Who did the Son of God come from? The children of Israel to redeem his people on right. themselves. This, right. this, this, this is the reason why I say this, though. Right. This is the reason why I say this. But here's what I'm saying that where I come from with the New Testament, is that because Jesus came to his people and his own denied him, he said, Thank you. Oh, and that's God. in the word. Now, now all of them denied him. That's in the word, though. No, 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 I'm not saying that. Because, everybody, because no, he wasn't saying, everybody. when you go to my house, when you go to my people hold up, hold up. and they don't accept you, he said, leave their house and dust the feet off and keep did, it pushing. Did, 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 what did he say? He said, keep pushing. Hold up. Let me ask you. So, did the 12 disciples, what were they? They were denied. They had been. Well, what does the number 12 represent? Well, Israel. You know, well, before we Israel. get that, let me ask you Why something. Why you got 12 disciples? Here's my question for you. Here's my question for you. What is the number one thing that he had the 12 for? To go teach Israel? Before he said, that, I command that, you to go that, teach before that. That. before that. What do you mean before, before that? that? I read the scripture. Before that. I got that. Before that. What did he what did it take for them to get back in alignment after Judas? No, what are you talking about? Got what new, did he got new uh, disciples. They fell out of the alignment. Why? Only because the number, they as a group, no, fell said, out of said, alignment. No, he said, I lost I lost none besides the sudden condition. Yeah. I'm talking about Judas. Now, I'm I'm still getting to this. What was it then? Judas. That they had to but they still had to cast lots. He didn't show up. He was here for 40 days before he even came back. It was in when they picked Matthias and said, him. I don't. I don't understand. I don't understand the point you're trying to make, though, because the scripture said these twelve. The lot fell listen, upon Matthias. He okay. said these twelve. Yahweh sent forth, commanded them, go now to the Matthias, way of the Gentiles. I, I'm telling you. Now here's here's my thing, though. How so? How be it? If as a group, all twelve tribes, if one misses. He can't move with it. What? Right. Got another one. What are you talking about? I get that. I get that now. But we don't have it today. Of course. Of course. That's why we. That's that's right. Right. We do have it today. We do have it today. We out here, ain't we? But I get that. But my soul comes under conviction, saying everybody can't get into into heaven. They can't. But what is heaven? According to you, what's heaven? From you think it's the old but, magical but, place in the sky? No, but I don't. I don't. Remember the swamp. He'll be, he'll right. make. That's the spirit world name. No, he, he, that's the spirit world. Okay, and he also said that he would make earth. When we all die. This will be the four corners of the earth. Israel will be Heaven will be on here. earth. That'll be the, the, the two watchmen. It'll be the gate that take you back. There's no. Between here and there. Now, here's the question. Whoa. As a, as all right, in, bro. In, in the form of so I'm, I'm going to say this. This is what I'm asking now. Is. Hmm. How can? <laughs> oh, oh, bro, go ahead. No, it, 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 you, you, it's simplistic because it I, is simplistic. I, I get it. Because what are you trying to say? You trying to say all I, I can't be saved? Because I can't go to I can't go to every country in this world and deny them that the God that they're believing and they're, they're praising and worshiping Hold on, is listen. wrong, and, and they're wrong man. for worshiping Him. Why can't, why I can't, can't you do that. The Lord did. That's what the first commandment said. Those that do it in vain. He said, don't really? worship. He said, don't all, worship me like everybody else worship me. First of all, they it, worship, they, the way that they worship, I've, I've witnessed other countries. I've been in the military. I've been around the world. I've watched and witnessed other other nations. And, but Israel scattered among all nations. So here's my question. So what's, what is the what is the Chinese man? What is the Japanese man? We got, got Israelites scattered over there. What are they? 
Mobites. Mobites, Ammonites. But well, we're we're scattered amongst them. We're, like, we have, like Bruce no, Lee. I, I got it. Bruce, Bruce Lee's in his alone. I got that. I got that. So how can we say that? I don't there think you do not, got it. Okay, what, what how can we say that then not anybody can be saved? That's those are different tribes. Those are different people. That's a different land. That's a different nation. Well, those are if, different if they're not Israelites, they're gonna be our, our slaves. In the kingdom. Ain't the Israelites chosen? Oh, now, you don't want to agree with now, that? Now, I got that. I understand that. There has to be somebody that doesn't believe. Now, I get that as well. It ain't about belief. It's about the Lord created a people unto himself. So what's faith, though? Special people. A, a special, peculiar people. A peculiar but people. If, but they're what saved by again? grace and faith. faith That's is, Israelites. That's Israel. Israel. That's we just read it. it. So everybody else is believing in vain. They, well, no, no. Those other people ain't believing at all. They're just front. They're lying. They're deceiving. But it's only Israel that's given that gift of faith. It's only Israel. The other nations don't know what faith is. They know from what they read in the book, though, but they in all reality, they don't know what faith is. So, no, 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 no. so how do I deny somebody's faith and say, well, they you believe, but you're not? Well, I get that. I get that. If somebody believes. If somebody truly, sincerely believe in the Lord with all their heart and soul, right. they we'll probably, they probably an Israelite. That's right. We, we ain't judging away. nobody just by the way they look. And Wait, like doesn't it. say, um, um, try the spirit? Yeah, try the spirit. Now, now, that's, that. That, now, we try the spirit. That's, that's where I'm coming from. That right, was why right, I was asking. Right, try the because, I, because being around in these seminaries, in these classes, yeah. I've found who I can believe. You found some demons and I in there. Found, bro, I done found <laughs> some people. I done had my children. Right. around me in these classes and I didn't stop bringing it because I don't like the spirit around me right. in this school. Right, okay. So I get that. But then that was the question I asked is, how do you, without discerning, right. without the spirit of discernment, right. how are you able to tell or discern or tell somebody like, you're not going to make it? Actually, sometimes it's very easy to tell somebody yeah. ain't going to make it. It's yeah. not hard. But the Lord in the, in the body, the but within the body, I, I'm speaking as in the, in, the, in, the, in, the, in the stance of ministry, without calling judgment, without fault, fight judge, from judge. yes, but I'm saying without in a righteous manner. Yes, I understand what you're saying. You see what I'm saying? Like, how do you go about? And this, this is why I come to them because I didn't, I couldn't get this from them. This is why I implore these questions because I've gotten an answer that is. Not so just probably, idealistic, but it's the word. They don't bring the word. I, I can't listen. To, I'll give you some phony ministries that I cannot listen to. I can't listen to Joel Osteen. I can't listen to a person that doesn't go to the word. Hey, you guys. I, I've never yeah. seen Joel Osteen. Out the the Israelite. Pick up that Bible. Yeah, yeah, we definitely the new Israelites. Right. Right. It's, it's, not, it's, it's, good, good, it's good to know some people Church know that we are the new Israelites new. of this world, man. The new Israelites. Yeah. No, we, we, we've been the Israelites. It's just not the same. Oh, you know what I'm trying to poke my eye out. Okay. It's just not the I'm same. Not the, it's just not the same. The thing is, the scriptures tell you, once you find brothers of understanding, uh -oh. you can, you, you, your command is to continue to be with the brothers of understanding. You know what I'm saying? You just can't think you got it all. You got to walk that straight gate. It's what is that straight gate? ever learning. He said, for I'm ever learning. Well, I, what's I, that straight I never have gotten all. I've never gotten all to understand. That's why I've been Monday every morning to ask me, God, but, what is it that you're going to show? But we, but we, 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 why else would we be here? But we do have all to understand, bro. <laughs> Trust me, bro. Like, I, bro, my wife been doing myeloma, skin cancer, breast cancer, and cervical Ooh, cancer. I was just very down there at the Greyhound, bro, asking God, bro, I have five dollars to my name. I literally, I, your wife and sister, this is my wife, yeah, 10 you know, years. That, that's a very fair Bro, I have five dollars to my name, Ooh. and I, I, I was asking God in the bathroom, really literally while I was using the bathroom, bro. I was like, Lord God, please help me with some type of finances. Right, right. Tell me why I use the bathroom. Walked up to this man, bro, and I was like, I, I explained my situation to him momentarily. He got changed for $180. Yeah. I'm dead ass, bro. I just got that. Oh, Lord knows my situation, bro. Lord knows what I could be out here doing. I just, prayer works, bro. Prayer works. That's why he wants you to be in the world, but not of the world, bro. This world yeah. is very evil. It's very demonic, bro. You got to learn to see me as a brother instead of a distant stranger. You feel me? I am your brother in Christ. That man with the headphones on, that is your brother in Christ. Oh, oh no, that. that's Ooh. that no, 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 because that's how oh, God, God taught you to love like that. Talk. You, you, you can't judge that man. Not if, not if, not if you can go over there and pray for that man, right? 
Bro, I'm afraid for him. On my kids, bro. I was walking past Grant Hospital. This is on my kids. I've tried suicide three times. Oh, I, I done tried Damn. suicide three times. You see my heart, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm walking past Grant Hospital. I do not know these three individuals, bro, at all. Wasn't asking them for nothing. Just tell, me, tell me why I, tell me why I stopped them, bro. And was like, excuse me, guys. You guys just came from the hospital, right? This is God speaking. I'm like, y'all just came from visiting and your grandmother, she's sick. I was absolutely accurate about what I was saying. You should have saw their faces were priceless, bro. How could I know that and have never met these people in my life? All I asked to do was pray for them, bro. And after that, bro, they, were just, they, they, they just couldn't believe that. They was all looking, how does he know that? How does he know? I, 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 I couldn't have, I couldn't have, I, I have been speaking and talking to God. I've been speaking to God. They didn't know that. They didn't know that, but I said something that was an accurate situation in those three. They had literally just left the hospital. Their grandmother is in the hospital, and she was sick. I uttered those words without not knowing these people at all. That's God, bro. That is God, bro. So it's a, it, it's a reason. It's a reason and a season for everything, bro. It's real. He's real, bro. All of the, for all the tyranny, for all the tyranny and all the trials and tribulations that we face as an economy, it's not by coincidence, man. It's God giving signs, bro, letting you know that, you know what I'm saying? His return is coming soon. Hey, check He's that out. He sent you another sign. He sent you out here to us. That's right. another that's sign. Why, that's why I turned around. That was the cherry on the top. That's why I turned around. You know it, baby. You know it. Yep. And don't be afraid to praise his name, man. What's his name? Don't be afraid to praise his name. What's don't his name? Don't be afraid to lift his name on high. What's his I name? I say Jehovah. I say Jehovah. That's Jireh. why. That's why you are here. I the say. Most, I'm gonna yeah. give it to you. Yes. Well, yes. The Most High's name is not Jehovah. I say Jehovah. The, the proper way. Listen to me now. In Hebrew, that's why you out here. The Most High got you out here. That happened. The Most High's name is Yahweh. It's in the Hebrew. Cause there ain't no J's in Hebrew. It was Yahshua. No, I, I listen to me now, listen. Was. The Most High's name is Yahweh. Hey, give me uh, uh, Proverbs 30, uh, 4. Yahweh? Yeah, Yah, it yeah. consists of two Hebrew words. Yah means he, and Hawa means to be or to exist. So the Most High's name uh, is Yahweh, Yahweh, which literally means he is or he, he's, he, he's the all existing one. Right. And yeah. his son's name is also Yah, which means he, and Hawashai, which means savior, means he delivers, he saves. You so did, do this, you believe in Jesus? His, yes, but his Hebrew name, he's a Hebrew Israelite. So he spoke Hebrew. Right. So his Hebrew name is Yahawashai, it's not Yeshua. Right, yeah, right, yeah. right, 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 you're right. Right. Here's you're my right. question for you. You're right, if, if, you're right. Now, I'm gonna ask this one question because Aramaic, not just being Hebrew. It's language. not Aramaic either, it's Hebrew. Aramaic is a... Uh, Tan, and here's my question. Yeah. Tell me what you think Aramaic is. Or tell me what you know. I know what Aramaic is. Aramaic is a so-called Semitic language. And what does Semitic mean? It comes from Shem. But, but the Hebrew, the biblical Hebrew, yes, that's exactly yeah, what it means. But what is Aramaic? Aramaic is, comes from Aram. Who's Aram? The ancient Assyrians. That's, where, also, it, 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 ah, that's okay. where it comes from. Because the ancient it, it Hebrew is, is way more ancient than uh, Aramaic. Yes. Because Aramaic is actually it's the same dialect. It's different dialects. Aramaic same. is the Hebrew, like same like same Spanish. Is, yeah. It's like Spanish is the Latin or something yes, like that. That's where I'm okay. Like if you can read Hebrew, you can read you Aramaic. Can read Aramaic. Mm -hmm. yep. Now that was the thing that they said is how does he know these letters and these words that were not even printed? This is this is Yeshua. Yahusha. Yahusha. He was reading in the temples a language that was not his. How is that not his language? He read the Isaiah scroll in front of the whole temple. That wasn't his language. That wasn't how he was raised. It wasn't Hebrew. The Bible says it wasn't how he was raised, though. That wasn't the language he was raised. Yeah, 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 yeah. I got this Acts 22. Hit quick with it. He got that shit. I wish I had more. I feel like it's an issue. I wish I had Because I don't have my sword. And it came to pass that as I made a journey and was come nigh unto Damascus about noon, suddenly there stone there shone from heaven a great light round about me, and I fell into the ground and heard a voice saying unto me, Saul, Saul, why persecutest thou me? And I answered, Who art thou, Lord? And he answered me. And he, and he said unto me, 
I am Yahweh Shai, Nazareth whom thou persecutest. And they, and they that were with him saw indeed the light with him. Oh yeah, in 26. This is 26. Oh, wow, this is green, man. <laughs> <laughs> hey, that's the same part. You, you close to it, though. It's right there. So you saying Aramaic? So what was your question, brother man? Oh, no, because a lot of people. A little bit about Aramaic. But they try to say to people try to say uh, the Lord spoke Aramaic, but that's not true. Go ahead. You got the scripture. He spoke all forms of it. Oh, I'm sure he can speak all languages ever created. I mean, yeah, yeah. but his right. native tongue is Hebrew. He's a Hebrew Israelite. I, I, I'm saying that. I, I know that. But there's more than one dialect of Aramaic. That's why I was asking, what is your belief of Aramaic? There's more than one dialect of Aramaic. And when teaching, and I, I, I can get it in my word. I don't have my word with me. I'm, Hey, listen to this. How are you teaching and reading things that were not your words? Well, hold on, listen. Words? And when we were all fallen to earth, I heard a voice speaking unto me. And saying, in the Hebrew tongue. In the Hebrew tongue. Okay. So, so, why first did you bow me? It is hard for me to kick against the bricks. So the Lord, he told Paul, and he spoke to Paul in Hebrew. And Paul was a Hebrew Israelite from the tribe of Benjamin. He tells you that in Romans 11. Paul spoke different tongues. Yeah, he was Paul was multilingual, period. Because he was a tax collector, he traveled throughout all Rome, everywhere. So that, that's a lie. They try to say uh, everybody in uh, Israel during the time of the Lord spoke Aramaic. That's one of the lies of the devil. Okay, because that, that, first of all, they don't want you to know that you're an Israelite. So that, give me that phone, baby, please. My, my main next, and I'm, I'm just imploring because I'm only gathering wisdom that I know and I'm piecing together from other Hebrew Israelites because I don't I'm not gonna say I don't identify myself as uh, uh, a term I'm, I'm term. simply uh, no uh, hear me please Israel and I, I, I what does the word Israel mean that's important he's a chosen people. no no what is the word Israel in Hebrew is Yasharala what does that mean it's got a meaning Yah once again means he just like the Here most high if right. Yah means he Anytime you hear Yah in Hebrew, that means He. Or like Hallelujah. Every time you see, that proves Most High's name is Yah. Even though they spell it with a J, nobody says Hallelujah. Everybody says Hallelujah. Because yeah, right. the Most High, you can call him Yah for sure. You go to church every Sunday, Hallelujah, Lord. They say Thank Hallelujah, you. but listen. I done been there. I done spoke in tongues before I got baptized, bro. Like, when yeah. the spirit moves, it's an unmovable Everybody, force. You cannot stop it, man. man. I'm Everybody, telling you. Everybody say hallelujah. But, right. uh, but one second, back to the word Israel. The word Israel is Yah, means uh, he. Shar means prince. And Allah means God. Okay, because uh, Israel in Hebrew means he's a prince of God. And Allah we is have hallelujah. Yeah, Allah yeah. is in there. Allah, you can't you can't get hallelujah without saying ah Allah. Uh, actually, I just, I actually, the word halal, uh, hallelujah actually comes from two words halal, halal in Hebrew means to exalt or to praise. So it's hallelujah. Halal means to praise, and Yah means Him. So you're saying right. praise Him. him. It, uh, exalted is he. right, right, or, right. It's really He. Because yeah, it, it's just he. It, it, it's just he. Because he is he. Because he is he. He is everything. And he is everything. He's, exactly. everything. He's all existing. What's your name, brother, man? It's uh, like Aharawan. Uh, Aharawan. I want to oh, hug you. I want to hug you guys, man. Right, I, I, oh, yeah, I did. I said right. I got it right. <laughs> God bless you guys. I'm about to get over here with my wife, man. God all bless right, you guys. Genesis 32 and 22. And he rose up at night and took his two wives and his two women servants. And it's, ooh, he's going off. He got two wives. Oh, no. Uh, yeah, he got two wives. <laughs> they probably throw you out of the church you came up in there with two wives. And his two women, so his 11th son passed over the full of Jephthah. And he took them and sent them over the brook and sent them over the back of hand. And Jacob was left alone. And there wrestled a man with him until the breaking of the gate. And when he saw that he prevailed more against him, he touched the hollow of his thigh, and the hollow of Jacob's thigh was out of joint, and he wrestled with him. And he said, Let me go, for the day break. And he said, I will not let thee go, except thou bless me. And he said unto him, Jacob demanded a blessing. Yeah, damn yeah, right. And that shows that he was a mighty man. Yeah. Right? Because he wrestled with an angel. He wrestled with an angel. Yeah, no. And he said unto him, What is thy name? The angel was 
Listen, listen, read that again. And he said unto him, what is thy name? And he said, Jacob. And he said, my name shall be called no more Jacob, but Israel. Like he said, Joshua. For as a prince has thou power with the most high and with men, it has prevailed. Yeah, so the angel, he told him the meaning of his name. Because he's with a prince of, with, 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 um, and he said, Thy name shall be called no more Jacob, but Israel. For as a prince hast thou power with the most high yeah. and with men and has Because that's what it means. A prince is, you're a prince of the most high. That's what Israel means. Yeah, a prince is the son of a king. You know what I'm saying? A prince is the son of a king. That's more reason why, oh, Romans 8. Let me get it. Let me get that. A lot of people don't understand this mystery we talk about. The mystery of the Gentiles. The, my the mystery of the church. It's not for everybody. Hey, that's proof.